Hey Wins, welcome to the channel. In today's video, we are going to be making an extreme hair growth mask. Thumbs up this video if you enjoyed it and subscribe if you haven't already. Also, watch this video to the end to get all the instructions. To begin, grab a bowl and a sieve just in case your herbs have got chaff in them so you can sieve them out to avoid it getting stuck in your hair. My first ingredient is marshmallow root powder. I'm going to be adding that in one tablespoon into this sieve. The next is going to be hibiscus powder. I'm equally going to be adding one tablespoon of that. I noticed that the hibiscus came with lumps and I found it difficult trying to break them into powder. The next powder is going to be fenugreek powder and I'm going to be adding in two tablespoons of the fenugreek powder. All the powders used in this video are carefully selected and are moisture protein balanced. Just perfect for both high and low porosity hair. Where I bought them would be spelled out on the screen and also linked in the description box just in case you would love to buy because a lot of you always always ask me where I get my ingredients from. Also the list of the ingredients will also be in the description box. For the very first time, I'm using Ayurveda with no chaff. From what you can see, I tried sieving the powders to see if I could see some chaff, but there was no trace of it and I had to pour it back and continued with the next process. So I poured it in a bigger bowl just to help with the mixing. I used warm water, not hot water, to mix. I poured sparingly. While I pour, I stirred just to make sure that I don't get this mask runny. I wanted a not so thick and not so runny consistency, if that makes sense. So this took me a lot of time to mix this takes time because of the marshmallow and the fenugreek because they are sticky as you already know that i love hibiscus so much hibiscus in this mask will help with moisture fenugreek will help with strength and marshmallow will help with sleep this is a perfect hair mask anyone can try out this mask can be used on all hair types, whether permed or natural. Do not say you're permed and you can use this. So this is perfect for everyone. I will be demonstrating how I use this mask. Please keep on watching to see how I use this mask. From what you can see, mixing takes a lot of time. You just have to be patient with the process so you can get the perfect mask. What I'm trying to do now is to break the hibiscus. I don't know why the hibiscus clogged together, making it uh, lumpy. So I was trying to dissolve that. <music> So at this point, I was happy with my results. This is the perfect consistency that I would love to use on my hair. Can you see how amazing this mask is? So smooth and just beautiful. So I'll go ahead and cover that up just to activate it because they are in powdered form. You have to infuse it kind of for just 30 minutes. And once that is done, 
go ahead and use it to coat your hair strands section by section you already know that i love to work in section each time i'm doing anything to my hair make sure to use this mask on freshly washed hair as you can see here my hair is clean i had already shampooed and deep conditioned next i'm using this mask on my hair this mask helps with hair thickness you can go ahead and read about the benefits of marshmallow for your hair benefits of hibiscus for your hair benefits of fenugreek for your hair i'm going to give you that as a take home assignment yeah right i repeat this mask can be used on all hair types permed and natural hair do not say you're permed you cannot use this mask this mask helps with hair thickness it helps with strengthening it helps with moisture it helps with grays gray hair hibiscus can actually darken your hair over time that is why i love to use hibiscus like i told you in my previous video if you're up to 20 years old and would love to avoid gray hair premature grays not that they won't come they will definitely come but if you want to delay it keep using hibiscus use it as your hair tea use it as mask use it in oils make hibiscus your friend so i love to use hibiscus and i love its darkening effects on my hair so keep using hibiscus and it helps with hair thickness if you use it consistently it's going to thicken your hair and also they both help with hair growth fenugreek and hibiscus they help a lot with hair growth the slippage that comes with this mask is mind-blowing the way it conditions and detangles hair is just it for me i so much love this mask the combo is amazing let me know the herbs that you love to combine together for hair growth let me know all of that in the comment section between mask and hair tea which is your favorite let me know in the comment section a lot of people prefer hair tea because it's very easy to wash off from the hair and others prefer mask because it's more potent and works faster so let me know your reason and which you prefer in the comment section so after using this to saturate the hair i covered my hair for up to five hours you can cover your hair up and go about your normal duties the more it stays in your hair the better it works cover your hair for as long as possible and then rinse off afterwards with normal water and not shampoo because i know somebody will definitely ask me are we to use shampoo for this no if you're using shampoo you're washing away the nutrients that is already embedded in your hair so you have to use water to rinse off and if you notice any particle in your hair please do not get yourself worked up because the more these particles stay in your hair the more they do the job remember they are 100 percent natural and the more they stay the more they work they need some time to work thank you so much for watching this video and if you enjoyed it please give me a thumbs up and see you soon